Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's just Billy LeBlanc. And I actually just realized that it's mostly not just Billy LeBlanc. I'm usually with somebody else. And today I'm with Mikey too. That's good guys. Hi. So in this video guys, I've realized through uh, many of you telling me that uh, I don't dress so great. You ain't got the drip. I don't. I, I wear <laughs> mostly Under Armour shirts and these jogging style shorts. You dress like a dad though. Like, but that's like good, I, right? I guess. I mean, my I dad, guess. that's literally all my dad wears is like, Underarm what you don't know is we actually go to a course on how dads dress and they teach us all this stuff. Oh, perfect. So I'm going to give you a course on how I dress. On a, oh, yes. A course on how <laughs> you dress and probably all the dads out there probably shouldn't <laughs> wear what I'm wearing, obviously. Yo, I, I, let me point this out. My dad is actually wearing the same shoes as Billy, <laughs> just in a different color right That's now. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, I went shopping for you. Yo guys, so I'm here at Zoomies um, at the mall by my house and I'm picking out Billy his first outfit. Hey, hey. Do you know any dads personally though that you look at him and go, that's not bad? Um, there are some dads that I'm like, Okay, like your son is obviously dressing you. <laughs> oh, okay, so you automatically assume if they're dressed good, it's because someone else is dressed yeah. <laughs> Got it. Sometimes. Got it. Like the sporty fit like you, like you obviously dressed yourself. Like Straight out of the catalog, yeah, the dad yeah. catalog. The, the dad, the dad uh, drip. That's what we call it, the dad drip. Okay. I'll be right back with you. Okay. I'm gonna do the more casual kind of, it's not a sporty fit. I mean, it could be, but it's more of like a casual. So casual, but chill. I didn't dress myself. Like, like, like a beach vibe kind of gotcha. kind of feel. So I went to Zoomies and I bought you a pair of shoes. All right. You need some Vans. Okay. You need some Vans. Vans are where it's at. So um, this is what I tell people you kids all the time. Such, he has such big feet too. Like, <laughs> so yes, I have big feet. The thing <laughs> with it is though, is you know how long white shoes stay white till they um, go on your feet? I've had these uh -oh. for two months. <laughs> That's the shoes. Okay, so this is, like I said, it's kind of casual. Gotcha. So I got you a pair of shorts. You know what Champion is? Yeah. They used to sell it at Walmart for like 15 bucks and now it's expensive for no reason. <laughs> for no reason. They, they got discovered, guys. And then they it's got just discovered. a matching shirt. Okay. So, so, um, so is, that a, is that a big thing? Maybe as a dad, I don't know. Is matching a big thing? Like you want to like... I mean, yes. Like what? you don't want to you don't want to go outside and get like a rainbow or a unicorn or something. What? So you got to... Yeah. I literally you, grab... Like I reach in and I grab shorts and then I reach in and grab a shirt and I usually actually don't look at what they look like until I put them on. This guy, <laughs> that is, okay. It's not the way to do it? Yeah, no. I, I feel like we, we, should go, we should go shopping together sometime and, you and teach you're, gonna, the ways. you're gonna see Billy's Instagram feed just change completely. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna have Gucci, Fendi, Prada, Louis, all of it. I don't know about that. No. All right, I'm gonna all go right. get into this stuff. <laughs> uh, let's do it. All right. Oh my goodness. What? So have you always been into fashion? Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm actually, uh, I, I've, I have something going on oh. um, with a, a pretty big brand. Uh, oh, that secrets I'm coming out today. With. Yeah, so I'm, I mean, like. Any I'm, idea when you're gonna announce that? Um, I mean, yeah, like I'm announcing it kinda right now, but you guys will know more soon. But can we, can we just talk about this? Dude, and he knew not to wear socks with it too. Like, he knew. Yeah, that, that fit goes crazy. Yo, that's fire. That's a fire fit. But guys, on a scale of one to 10, how, how fire is this fit? Let us know in the comments. For sure. For real. But this is, this is just uh, fit number one. I got two. Okay. Two. And the other one is more like casual, like just hanging out for the day, maybe going to an event. All right, guys, so before he goes and changes, um, I got him a little shirt. Hold on, let me tuck this in. Okay, I got him a little shirt. Is Jay Z and Notorious B.I.G. Yeah, I mean, it's a pretty fire shirt, right? Do you know you know who they are, right? Of course. Of course. Yeah. Of course. And then just a regular pair of blue jeans. So, um, 
<laughs> you know, you want to know a funny story is that these were the only size 36s in the whole store. <laughs> Sounds about right. <laughs> so, so what's your opinion on like the whole rips in the jeans? I mean, I personally can say I've never really worn ripped jeans. I think that's really like, perfect. Back when yeah. I was younger, we got our rips on purpose. Like oh. by playing in our jeans. Oh yeah, I don't know how it turned into a fashion. I feel like if they're ripped, they should be 30% off or something. Yeah, Like a discount, discount you know? And I, like same with shorts, like they're half a pant. Give us a discount, you know? <laughs> you hear that story? <laughs> half a pant. We're not calling them shorts anymore. We're taking it back. Half, half a, a pant. pant. <laughs> Something I would wear. So here we go. All right. H&M, baby. H&M. Yo, what? I am just, yo. Are you two for two? Right here. Wow, yep. Most I'm definitely. Those are fire. How how comfortable? Don't don't rip them, you know. Don't rip them already. They're already ripped. They're already you know? ripped enough. Yeah. You don't need to rip them anymore. Definitely. Now let me tell you. So so most of your life, I guess, ripped jeans have been a thing. Yeah. Right? I mean, when I was younger, it was like the baggy uh, kind of pants. It was always hard for me to find a pair of jeans just because, like, I have really long legs and like. Oh, gotcha. Um, I'm also extremely skinny. So here's here's a, a sad reality I'm gonna tell you right now. Huh. Is that one day you're gonna be a dad and you're gonna wear all this cool stuff that you've been wearing your whole life and your kids are gonna look at you and go, what's that? <laughs> That's not in. Ripped jeans? Oh my gosh, why would you wear ripped jeans? Baggy jeans are in. Because yeah. as the trends change, what happens, I think where dads get their dress, is we just didn't. <laughs> That's what we wore when we were younger, and so it's cool still. Yeah, um, I, I, I don't like baggy pants. Um, hate them. Um, hate is actually a strong word. I don't hate them, but I dislike <laughs> myself in them. Um, and like bulky shoes, like there are these Balenciagas. Um, do you know what Balenciaga is? I have no clue what that is. Okay. <laughs> uh, have you heard the song by Cardi B? She's like, those Balenciagas, the ones that look like socks. Yeah. Okay. I was referring to that brand. Um, they're these shoes that they make and they're so bulky and they're so nasty looking on me. And I, I just hate the way they look in general. They're just not appealing <laughs> not to the eye. Not your thing at all? Yeah. Gotcha. So. Well, this I mean, was awesome, man. Like. Dude, you, Seriously. you're actually like fitted so, up right now. You guys have to vote in the comments. Outfit one or outfit two. Yeah. Mikey did a great job today. A lot, a lot of you at home probably didn't know that he's working with a fashion brand. Yeah. He's coming out with some good stuff. So check that out when it comes out. Yes, and remember to go uh, follow Mikey on all his social media and on YouTube. Yep, at Mikey Tua.